There have been some rumblings about possible job cuts and program changes at UNC Greensboro. So we went straight to the chancellor to get answers. He told WFMY News 2's Giselle Thomas there's a lot he wants to clear up. UNCG Chancellor Frank Gillum tells me the university is in the process of conducting an academic portfolio review. He says it hasn't been done in over a decade and the purpose is to review and evaluate programs for their relevancy. Now this comes after state funding is determined by enrollment. The chancellor says they've lost 2,500 students in the past three to four years. We have a deficit, so that's one reason to do it, to say, okay, what, what should we really be doing? What can we afford to do? What maybe what can we not afford to do? He says he wants to clear up what he calls misinformation about certain programs. He believes rumors started after the university hired a data collection group to look into programs the university offers, and that's all. We hired a consultant, RPK, whose job it is to help you clean up your data and build dashboards and that be to the university community publicly available. They make no recommendations on any actions. That is not their job. Now we heard some claims that the nursing program was going to face cuts. Here's what the chancellor had to say. I can say with clarity that nursing will be at UNCG as long as I'm at UNCG. We just built them a hundred million dollar building. Now the chancellor says the academic portfolio review is still in progress and no programs have been selected. He says we won't see the results of the decisions until the next two to four years.